Hello everyone and welcome to this brand new episode on our YouTube channel, Rescoli by Carlo. Well, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is Rescoli by Carlo, and comment, like, and share our videos. So, and today it's going to be about lampshades. How can we decorate our homes? our apartments and the place where we live with uh, small details that are lampshades and how they can um, basically make all the impact in our home. We're now uh, being accustomed to new and, not, uh, and innovative ways of lighting our spaces, but lampshades are an all-time favorite in all settings and environments so let's go and we're starting with with the entrance uh, of our home and then we'll go bit by bit uh, to show you all our lampshades that we have right now obviously during the evening the effect is much nicer but because of lighting obviously we're, we're, we're doing this video right now which is uh, an afternoon uh, on a weekend let's go and here is the entrance to our home and here we have two lampshades and also a couple of wall lights um, this let me show you how uh, the effect changes this is how the hole looks when it's all lit up but uh, we're switching off so that you can see the effect of the lampshade so here we have one over here including this the the hand sanitizer which is an obligation when you come into our house we have a lit up alcove which just a light so that uh, there's dramatic effect on our statue and on the side we have this lampshade here which is quite a big one and this shade has been friendshiped. Basically, we did some hornblower and some gold frenchine on it, so the light does not show from the shade here. It's uh, just a blackout, but the light comes from underneath and on top. So basically, you have the roof here, the ceiling here, and the wall lit up. Next step. Yeah, we're starting with this alcove. Uh, we just did a hidden lighting so that there's this dramatic effect. We uh, included the wooden paneling at the back so that the stone would be reduced and left for the outside. And here we have this beautiful lampshade, which was a bargain. Uh, it looks really, really cute. We have some wall fixtures as well. And on the other side, we have this lampshade here. We put a little bit of cloth to reduce the amount of light coming from it. So that the effect is like the one in the hole. Uh, lighting underneath and the ceiling. Here we have two lampshades, one a lamppost and one a nice decorative shade dividing the two rooms from the dining room to the living room. And the effect of this is that they uh, put some light on the ceiling as you can see there the effect and below and these are the original shades so we decided to keep the original uh, shades and this is the effect of the lampshade so you can see 
how it goes and how it blends with all the different styles we have in the house. And now we can go on the other side. Here we have this lamp sheet here. It's also uh, an original shade. Um, and the effect on the mirror is amazing. So uh, a very good idea would be, a very good inspiration would be to use as much as many mirrors as you want in front of lampshades and that creates double the light. And here we have this Moroccan style shade over here, which is a lamp post. It's uh, a metal one, even the shade is metal. And here in the corner, in front of another mirror, we have this lampshade here. So these are all uh, ideas you can use as an inspiration um, to decorate your own uh, little piece of heaven. And here we have the we have another shade over here. And this is also an original, and this is the effect, lighting below and lighting the ceiling. Here we have another shade on our desk, which is a classical old piece of lighting. And in the corner here, we have the last one for today. It's also in front of a mirror, so you can see how dramatic it looks and how beautiful it makes the place look. Well, this has been our last uh, shade that we've shown you for this inspirational video. We're switching off the lights, as you can see, uh, because it's still very early in the afternoon and uh, we don't want to waste energy not because we don't want to uh, pay the bill but mainly because it is a waste of resources uh, you've seen the effect on the on the mirrors but Discussing mirrors will be for another episode all together. Thank you for following us. Don't remember to well remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel Rescue by Carlo. See you next time. Ta-ta.